that is derivatives of implicit functions that is next section let f of x comma y equal to 0 let f of x comma y equal to 0 that is function of x and y from this function if x k y a respected represent kote na pari othoba y k x a respected represent kote na pari that means a function theke jodi x k y a respected represent kora na jay ba y k x a respected represent kora na jay ta hole such type of function ke amra bolbo implicit function tale let f of x comma y equal to 0 is an equation of two variables <coughs> x and y <coughs> clear if x is not represented by y if x is not represented by y or y is not represented and y is not represented by x then f of x comma y equal to 0 is implicit is implicit functional equation and a form x comma y is called implicit function and a form x comma y is called implicit function. For example, for example, let a form x comma y equal to x square plus y square. Is it an implicit function? Taking a for x comma y equal to 0 that is x square plus y square equal to 0 so you have x square equal to minus y square so that is x equal to plus minus root over of minus y square that means plus minus y square means y and root over of minus 1 is r. So x equal to plus minus y r. Since x can't represent by y. Why? Because x is real. Here f of x comma y equal to x square plus y square. Where x, y belongs to real number. x ke kintu y a respect te represent kora jat chhe na. Tad karun x equal to plus minus y i hoi jat chhe. And x is real. Here x is real. But plus minus y i. But plus minus y i not a real number. So x square real equal side and left side and real as a right side a complex number. That's why equality occur kotte parena. So equality does not occur. So equality does not occur. That's why x ke ami y a respect te represent korte parbo na 
so x cannot be represented by y similarly y cannot be represented by x in this similar reason similarly y cannot be represented by x similarly y cannot be represented by x so so a of x comma y equal to x square plus y square is a implicit function is a implicit function but but let a of x comma y equal to x square minus y square for all x y belongs to R where x y both are real numbers. Now my question here this f one taking f one x comma y equal to this. Now my question here f one is implicit function or not? So taking f one x comma y equal to zero, that's why x square minus y square equal to zero. So you have x square equal to y square. So that is nothing but x equal to plus minus y. So x is represented by y. Another. Y equal to plus minus x. Another y can be represented by x. Therefore, f one x comma y is a function of x and y, but still, which is not an implicit function. Here, x can be. represented by y and y can be represented by x y can be represented by x so f1 is Not an implicit function. So what you get? You get a is implicit function, but f one not an implicit function. So you see, look, the function data x and y is a variable. So the f of x comma y equal to zero. फांगशन So implicit function means f of x comma y equal to zero is a function of x and y. If x can't be represented by y or y can't be represented by x, then f is called implicit function. Now, what is my next approach? My next approach to know about. What is differentiation of implicit function? What is derivative of implicit function? Taking an implicit function, let that is example one.
let x cube plus 3x square y minus 2y cube equal to 5 is an implicit function. Why it is an implicit function? I can't represent x in terms of y. That's why it is an implicit function. Find dy dx. Find dy dx. So at first, you take this equation x cube plus 3x square y minus 2y square equal to 5. Find dy dx, that means differentiate with respect to x. So you can write differentiate both sides with respect to x. What you get? ddx of x cube 3x square y minus 2y square equal to ddx of 5. So that is plus, that is minus. So let me break So you have ddx of x cube plus ddx of 3x square y minus ddx of 2y square equal to ddx of constant term is 0. ddx of x cube means you have 3x square plus 3 is constant into ddx of x square into y that is uv formula applying uv formula x square into ddx of y plus y into ddx of x square minus 2 constant by the cholero you have ddx of y square that is equal to zero. so what you get you have 3x square plus 3x square dy dx because here I have y that is not a function of x. So I can write dy dx. Because I am not to give dy dx. I am to give dy dx. to write dy dx. Plus 3 into y. ddx of x square is also 2x. 3 into y into 2x. Minus 2 into ddx of y square. You know y square that is a function of y. In the x. You apply for the chain rule apply for the. He could have a chain rule apply. It is a y l function. It is a y l function. It is a y on the other one. A function that is a y l respected derivative for the other So you have ddy of y square. What is my new variable? y. What is my aim? It is an XL respected derivative product. So you have chain rule and you have dy dx. J is a notun variable y. You have our ultimate aim XL respected derivative product. Time we keep all up dy dx. Here. Notun the variable ta take a derivative product with respect to x. So you have 3x square plus. 3x square dy dx plus 6xy minus 2 dy dx into dy d dy of y square that means 2y d dx of x square is 2x so d dy of y square is 2y that is equal to 0 Common dy dx, you have 3x square minus 
2 into 2 4 y that is equal to it again you know I got it again you know it is equal to minus 3 x square plus 6 x y so what is dy dx dy dx is nothing but taking minus 3x square plus 6xy by 3x square minus 4y. 